Happy Monday, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us here in the Collector's Corner today. I'm just too excited. That's the problem. Too excited. It's been a while since we've opened up cards here in the Collector's Corner. Aris, alongside the lovely Leslie. Hi, everybody. Oh, my goodness. It is so great to be back here opening up beautiful, beautiful baseball cards. What are we opening up today, you ask? Well, it's in the title of this video, of course. It's off of our top series one baseball break. We're going to start things off with opening up two of these value packs. Then we're going to move on to two of these, two hanger boxes. Then we'll take a little trip down Blaster Boulevard and open up two of these before finally arriving at the House of Hobby, a hobby box. Pretty exciting stuff. What do you think? I'm pumped. I bet you are. All right. If you haven't done so already, be sure to follow us, facebook.com slash Collectors Corner TN, or on Instagram at Collectors Corner TN. And of course, subscribe to us, see what we post on our eBay page, ebay.com slash Collectors Corner TN. Without further ado, we're going to get into the break today. Thank you so much for joining us here. We're going to start off with the value packs. Looking for relic and autograph relic cards in here. 40 cards per value pack. Hopefully we do get one of those special inserts and we'll get 30 to 38. A breakdown of what we can get in here. Hoping for the best. Feel free to chat with us here on the good old YouTube. We'll chat about anything. Cards, baseball, soup, back hair, whatever you want. You already had a conversation about back hair before you. I did have a conversation about back hair. I mean, who hasn't? I mean, I haven't today. Talking about back hair, post game hand wash. Cody Hewer, rookie. You haven't today, but that doesn't mean that you won't. Do you want to talk about back hair? No. Okay. Select that card. Chadwick Trump, elbows only. Yeah, that happens. Max Scherzer with his freaky deaky eyes. Former Tennessee Smokey Wilson Contreras. Mitch Moreland. That Mike Trout fellow. Shane Bieber. How good has he been? Matthew Boyd. Boy. Justin Verlander. Chrome. Going to Houston. Who gives a what where you're from? I was just in Marshalls a couple days ago. Shameless plug for the TJX Rewards card. Uh, and they had a bunch of Houston Astros doggy jerseys, which I thought was very interesting here in East Tennessee. Joey Bart rookie for Los Gigantes. That does seem very odd. Yeah, it was very peculiar. But you never know what you might end up with in, uh, you know, looking through the Marshalls or the Ross. Selection. Fulty. Another former Smokey, Javier Baez. We're located in beautiful East Tennessee, Kodak, Tennessee, to be more precise. The double A affiliate of the Chicago Cubs, the Tennessee Smokies. Right here in the front office, Christian Yelich. He's actually in a Tennessee right now. Played a game, played a couple games for the Nashville team, the Nashville Sounds. As he's on his way to recovery, the Brewers hope so at least. On to the second value pack. Senzel, 
he started off very well this year. cards you can see run together. Garrett Richards, Aristides Aquino, Daniel Johnson, Dalton Marshall, Santiago Espinal, Isaac Paredes, it's pretty cool Nolan Ryan. K-bombs, Chris Bryant. Burroughs, Bobachette, Heimer Candelario, former Tennessee Snake. Michael Franco, former Philadelphia Phillies great. And by great, I mean everyday player, unfortunately. Kirby Yates, Archie Bradley, Yachty. Reese Hoskins, not the best variations there. So ends our value packs. We're going to go on to the hanger boxes, 67 cards in the hanger. Looking for autograph and relic cards, as always. The breakdown of the back. Feel free to chat with us once again, boys and girls. Only one card per envelope. May, May 6th, with postmarked by May 12th and received by May 19th. Time's running out. Man, if you haven't postmarked your uh, cards, you're not going to get them. Yeah. Because you can get free cards without purchase, remember? What have you done with my uh, opener? I've not touched the opener. opener is no longer here. I have a Sharpie. Oh, no. Somebody has taken the box cutter. A plot twist. It, this is thickening. I don't see it. What am I going to do? Raw dog it? <laughs> Rip it like this? Yes, I can. It's not that big. But... Make her sweat a bit. Scissors? That's the best I could do on such short notice. Fair enough. I mean, I did get it open. Don't run this one. I, I won't. Those, those are for Tolina. It says Tolina on them. Well, they came out of bread today. <laughs> <laughs> well, then. I never. Luis Garcia. Evan Longoria. Looking pretty... Pretty long in the tooth there, Evan. Miles Nicholas. JT, JD Martinez. Hector Neris, the boy. Have you been keeping up with Major League Baseball this season, Leslie? Uh, no, not Pretty sweet Albert Almora there. Not as much as I want to. I've been pretty busy here with this uh, work thing. Mm -hmm. There is something there, Nothing else is shiny coming up here. Pulled this post game hand wash card every time, though. Thank God. Nice. Paulo Monty Harrison for the Marlins. Pretty cool. Ronald Acuna, he's pretty all right. Cover boy, Juan Soto, Joe Adele. Soon to be, soon to be, uh, everyday guy for the Angels, Bryce Harper. Here's Junior.
Henry Aaron. Heard of him before. Sweet throwback logo there. Going to Milwaukee. Young Jock, Jacob Brom, Brandon A. Another cool Acuna. I know the Yankees aren't doing that hot this year. John Carlos Stanton, formerly known as Mike Stanton, put on the DL. Three Yanks. Chris Davis still getting paid. Freddie Freeman. Shohei Atani tied for the lead lead in home runs. It was a few days ago that Otani pitched the first seven innings of a ball game, and then he decides to go and play the outfield right after in the eighth inning. Don't see that very often from your starting pitcher. Really? Oh, yes. Yes. That he did. Mm -hmm. So a little backstory, as we said, that we're, uh, we're located right here in the front office of the Tennessee Smokies. Proud doubly affiliate of the 2016 World Champion Chicago Cubs. Last night, or, yeah, it was last night. Well, evening, evening oh, yeah. Evening. Afternoon, whatever. Uh, on the road, the boys are on the road in Madison, Alabama, mm -hmm. home of the Rocket City Trash Pandas. Quite the quite the affair. Went into the thirteenth inning of a six game trip, mind you. So game six of six. In inning thirteen, the Tennessee Smokies exhausted their entire pitching core and put in the catcher to pitch. The, the final inning. Mm -hmm. uh, didn't work out so well for Eric Castillo, the, the catcher, pitching. Gave up a grand slam, walk up grand slam to lose it's the game. Second grand slam of that game. Yeah, their second grand slam of that game. Yeah. So that's one way to lose a ball game. Yeah, but I mean, like, your catcher something. <laughs> what? what do you expect out of the guy? Not to be a pitcher. Exactly. Not to not to strike anybody out. I'll give you that. Right. <laughs> yeah, the Smokies are I'm like, proud of them. They they recorded the first ever hit, the first ever RBI, the first ever home run, and the first ever win inside of Toyota Field, home of the Rocket City Trash Pandas. But then, unfortunately, they lost the next five games in that six game series. But hey, they got that initial dub. Chrome Steven Strasburg, the Nats. Sweet little hit there. Buster Posey. Pattern. Pattern Posey. Look at that. 17 of 70. You like that alliteration, don't you? Cool. Dylan Carlson, the man of many positions. Looks like he just had a really big swing and a miss right there, but good hit for the cards. Joe Adele. Light that baby up. Oh, 
this. Interesting. So, number one in a series of one double Mookie bets. I've never seen this before, so that's why I'm a little perplexed at it. Topps issued his inaugural set in 1951 with two types of cards, the blue backs less common than their red back counterparts. They were shipped in packs of two that cost a penny, featuring superstars such as Yogi Berra, Bob Miller, and Johnny Mize. For a tabletop game. Huh. Well, learn something every day. Mookie going to the Dodgers. Another Joe Adele. Tyler Stevenson. Pretty awesome looking card there. Something that you would see out of the Sandlot. Casey Mize. Sixto Sanchez. What do you call a man with a rubber toe? Roberto. I'm pretty sure you laughed. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't think it was a pity laugh. I've heard your pity laugh many a time. On to the blasters, boys. Look for exclusive Cody Bellinger highlight cards inside. Exclusive only at Target on this box right here. Yeah, exclusive only at Target. I'm sure everybody's heard about that, how that doesn't exist anymore. All cards have been pulled out of Targets. So, wow, is this even more rare than before? Wow. You're welcome, guys. These are the patch cards that we can get. I've said boys and girls many a times. I appreciate that, Frank. Probably more than you. <laughs> so the patch card will wait till the end on that one. Good luck in the blasters. Jerks and Profar. Will Smith, dude only plays once every other game, but he's already... Okay, now there are some... There is some damage to this pack, at least. Hopefully, that doesn't carry through all of them. But all of these cards are dented straight out of the pack. That is unfortunate. The stink. Go the ding. Go the Torres. These look a little messed up too. Hmm. Okay, if the next pack is also uh, messed up, we're going to have to go and get like another box or something because all these cards are here. So. Sucks. 
sunny gray. <coughs> Christian Pache. Dude is a rocket. Right, let me see if this one. These are ding too. We're going to have to go to another box here. These look all right. We'll keep an eye out. Got a chrome, it looks like, in this one. So that's good. <laughs> Lewis Brinson, Wit. Bellinger, unprecedented power. Chrome, Glaber Torres. Austin Riley, Gio Urshela, Cisco Mejia, Roman Flores, Blake Snell, Corey Seager, Marcus Simeon. That's a pretty cool one. Francisco Lindor, Indians. Throwback card. Aaron Judge. Wilson Contreras, hollow. Damage to the card. No, no. Yeah, these these corners are messy. Andres Jimenez. J.D. Davis, Logan Quinn, Tommy Edmond, Joe Gallo, Weaver, Cool, Luis Roberts, throwback. That's dinged in the corner. Nick Madrigal. White, Hector Kiermaier, Marco Gonzalez, Clayton Kershaw. Crazy that dude has been around. Well, it seems like Kershaw has been along, along, yeah, along for a while. He was 20 years old when he was pitching against the Philadelphia Phillies in the NLCS in 2008. So that would make him 33 now? On our patch card, good luck. Going to the Boston Red Sox, Pedro Martinez. Who 
can see the blue heart right there. That'll require a thick boy. On our second blaster here, hopefully uh, everything will be crystal clear on it. Looking for exclusive royal blue base parallels. Blue, Shane Bieber. Nice to the Indians. Hollows and Eric Sogard for the Blue Crew. Something numbered coming out. Oh. Through the years, Hank Aaron would have been nice. Derek Cole, Freddie Freeman, Rafael Devers, Marcelo Zuna, Sonny Cole. We have another break coming up after this. We're opening up a bunch of heritage. Stay tuned on that. Yaz, Jesus Sanchez, Meyer, Buck Farmer. Ooh, some green here. Jacob Smith, Luke Weaver, Kevin Kiermeyer, to Danny Duffy. A face only a mother could love. That is ninety one of four ninety nine. Your Royals. Plenty of Dolan Barsha to go around. Former Visalia Rahad. Pictures in this pack here. Jesse Ramos, another blue coming up is a nice Mike Fulton Edwards. Fulton. Atico, Gio Gonzalez, we'll see the first. Anna, Julian Calhoun, Salvador Perez, second year Roberts, Howard oh, Pujols, Cal Ripken, Platinum Year, nice little O's hit, and the die cut. Boy, 
बाकी से तो पहले Julio Urias, Max Kepler, Homer Ford, that's in 20 grade. Josh Reddick, Yusuf Gravel, Andres Jimenez. On to our second patch. What will it be today? Saw Pedro in the first one. Tom Seaver, New York Mets. Sharp looking card for Tommy Boy right there. Nice. Cool card there. Cool card. Go to the Mets. On to the hobby box. Looking for one autograph or relic card in every hobby box. Per box on average. Let's do it. Oh, something crazy in this box. Really want to know where the box cutter went. I don't know either. Because <laughs> it's mine. Good luck in the hobby box, everybody. Let's make magic happen. Kibbert Ruiz, Ryan Mount, Mount Castle. Good start on the Mount Castle there. David Peterson. The Mets. Nice little run now for the Mets in this break. A lot of Jimenez cards. Another post game hand walk. Die cut coming. Nomar Mazzara. Bobby Ray. Reggie Jackson for the Yankees. Gotta wear those glasses. Gotta be able to see. Right, Leslie? Right. Brian Yarbrough. What's the country of origin on that name? Yarbrough. You know? <laughs> what do they teach you in that school of yours? Out of nowhere, Carlos Correa. Player worn memorabilia. Congratulations on that. A super hit. Well, Theophanopoulos <laughs> is very ethnic. Yeah, but like, I just never knew that. You know? Yeah, I guess you're right. Congratulations to the Astros. Maybe a little bit of dirt. In between? Dirty. 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 
cool. Correa. Only in pack number two, I think? Is that box? Pack number three? Congrats on that. For Asher Purchaser. Lakeith. Jesus Aguiar. Stars in service. Christian Yelich. Nico Horner. Who you're thinking of Billy Mays Hayes? Edward Olivares, Jose Abreu, Alberto Mangasi. Still waiting to see him play this year. Definitely not helping my fantasy team. Vladimir Guerrero, only player in. Hall of Fame to be in there as an Eagle. Fitting enough. There he is in his Washington, in his uh, Montreal Expos jersey. So that will be going to the Nationals. Glaber. One of the big stories out of this past week was how Oakland Athletics were pretty much told that you need to uh, get out of Oakland. Crazy. A lot of talks of them moving to Nashville. Or maybe they'll be going north of the border. To Canada, eh? Fortunate enough to see a Oakland Raiders game at the at the uh, Oakland Alameda Coliseum a few years back. Who would have known that the Raiders wouldn't exist there for so long? Granted, you know they've moved around here and there. We'll see how long they stay in Las Vegas. Um. Yeah, they need like a new facility or something really badly for uh, Ian Anderson. I mean, that place is a dump. We'll give them that much. So it's like the stadium is in the hood and it's in the middle. Yeah, they need, to, they need to build a new stadium. They're pretty much like forcing their hand that they need to build a new stadium. Maybe they'll go to Philadelphia from the Philadelphia effort. You know, Philadelphia may be one of those the cities that has like two teams. Could you imagine the city of Philadelphia is another team there? I don't think five people. That would be really weird, you know? I don't really understand how it works, to be honest. Like, bringing a new team is just like. People that are just fed up with the old team just say, hey, I'm going to jump ship and go to the other team. <laughs> I mean, yeah, just imagine it. Like, they, they become, like, you know, an AL team. So it's like they wouldn't have to really play each other at all. 
loves to it. Matt Chapman. That is very true. Dave Denning. The north side and the south side. In Philadelphia, where they have literally all the sports teams on the same, like, corner, like, block. Where you can... The Philadelphia Union don't play there, yes. <laughs> they play in, uh, the, uh, they play in Chester, Pennsylvania, like, 45 minutes outside of Philadelphia. Okay, uh, of the major four sports. I didn't know you were such a soccer fan. I'm really not, but... It's a major league team. It's a professional franchise. Yeah. That is. Roberto Clemente. Transition. Anywho, what I was going to say was. Outside of Major League Soccer, the uh, the top four sports teams all play pretty much right next to each other. And if they were to build another stadium, it would have to be like somewhere else in Philadelphia. It would have to be like the other side of the city. Yeah, that's another way to put it. I don't know. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> They can go play in Chester. <laughs> On the contrary, I've been to many Philadelphia Union games. Oh, have you? Yeah. Okay, so like, it's a great, it's a great spot, and I've never been in there. I don't know if you know this. Um, I probably do, but go ahead and tell the folks at home. They they put it there specifically to revitalize that area. Yeah. But then the staff took away it happened, and then just none of the revitalization actually happened. So there was a good reasoning behind it. Yeah, and they wanted a lot of like, oh, take public transportation to the book for the game and all that. But yeah, it is a beautiful stadium. We're located right on the water, not in the best part of town. Very close to the uh, Harris Casino, if you're into that. I need degenerates walking along with me here. Fernando Tatis. We'll see. Cool. Barry Larkin throwback for the Reds. Yeah, I used to go to a lot of Union games because you could get to sit, you could sit like right behind uh, the goalie for like, I used to get tickets for like 20 bucks. Mm -hmm. First row, like pretty fun stuff. A lot of craft beers on tap mm -hmm. at soccer games. Did you now? His wife? No, him. Oh. Oh, that would make more sense. Yeah. 15 of 199, Buster Posey, red. That's another. We had a numbered Buster Posey earlier, didn't we? I believe so. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. Look at that. Two numbered Poseys. A pocket full of them, you could say. So you walked right by Zach Ertz. Mm -hmm. Did you happen to snag a photo? No. So had, it didn't happen. We had security guards out the wall people around him. I bet half the people didn't even know who he was. I have to say, I didn't recognize him at that first version of either. And my sister was like, is that Zach? And my sister, all people. I was like, oh my god, yeah, what? Okay, and this first card is 
super bent. Let's kind of zoom in, focus. There you go. It's a, it's a hangnail, all right. <laughs> oh my! So is he a quite large individual? <laughs> He didn't need the shoulder pads. No, he <laughs> We're actually coming near the end of this break here, which I'm shocked about. Only a couple packs remaining. Smith. You used to work for uh, somewhat for the Philadelphia Union, isn't that right? Um, it's kind of like football. There's no real affiliation between them, but I did work for them for a little bit. Okay. Um, and then, I mean, that's interesting for the people I already know. Yeah. 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 Gavin Lux. David Bodie. Bodie. Quinn, Tom Edmund, Patrick Sandoval, Miguel Rojas, Sean Yamaguchi, Jack Flaherty. Think this one. Chadwick Trump for days. Brandon Workman, Bobby Dahlbeck, first one of him. Throwback Mariano Rivera. Casey Mize again. You're here for the heritage break. That'll be coming up in approximately 11 minutes. So you're a little bit early. Stay tuned on the channel for that. Brandon Nimmo. Through the years, Ken Griffey Jr. Teoscar Hernandez. Shine, yeah. Marlon Gonzalez going to the Minnesota Twins. Twinning. Jimenez, Nick Madrigal, Al Boom, Michael Taylor, Gio Ursula, Francisco Mejia, Kyle Seeger, Matt Stassi, Charlie Marte throwback, Juan Soto, Brady Singer. 
first Brady card. He stumbled out of the gate, but he then he did very well in his next couple of starts. I think he's still a little bit eager. On to the hobby exclusive for trading cards in the black pack. Thanks again so much for joining us here today. We look forward to seeing you back in the collector's corner very shortly. Starting off. Luis Robert. Going to the White Sox. A bad A. Looking hard. Next up. Evan White, rookie for Seattle. Congrats on the Evan White. Next up. Another Mariner, Ichiro Suzuki. Going back to back. And final card of the break. Is a Jordan Alvarez green for Houston. And that one is numbered 78 of 99. Congratulations to Houston on the final hit of the break. Thanks again, everyone, for joining us in the Collector's Corner. We hope to see you back very shortly. And we'll be back in just five minutes, actually, for our Heritage Break.